I'm always one step behind Wishing I could read your mind But I'm ready Yeah, never ready uh, I wish I could have made it stop The first time that you stood me up I wasn't ready Yeah, never ready Like a forbidden fruit I'm still craving for I'm still Welcome back to another video. I'm so glad to have you here with me today watching today's video. Um, I'm going to work on my living room. Uh, I just gave you a like a 360 look on my living room. It needs to be dusted. It needs to be vacuumed. I've got blankets that need to be folded and put away. Um, the kids have stuff out here like Bella's laptop. Um, the um, I've got boxes of pet supplies that I need to just kind of put away. They have baskets under the cage that um, I have organized for food and toys that I need to just kind of put away. Um, the tables need to be dusted, the furniture needs to be dusted, and um, I wanted to wash the carpet, but we have a carpet um, a carpet washer, but my husband has never showed me how to work it, so um, I can't do that. But um, hopefully I, I will be able to do that in an upcoming video, and I will show you guys how our carpet what our carpet cleaner works because it is a rainbow carpet cleaner and i have been on youtube for a little over a year and i have not seen anyone else use a rainbow carpet cleaner and um it's a vacuum um room humidifier and uh or no, a room purifier and a carpet washer so i've never seen a video with a rainbow combo like that so once i learn how to do it i will be sure to make a video on how i'm using it so that you guys can see um that piece of equipment um so without further ado let's jump into the video and get my living room looking <laughs> Tell what's wrong or right Should I go without saying goodbye All I know is I need to be Somewhere else to set me free I don't know what to do now Need to figure it out But I don't know how I hope the wind will carry me And take me away to where I should be to let you guys know that if you happen to see me sway in an ugly way i am listening to billy eilish she is one of my favorites and um i just love her songs so she is i just love her voice it's so relaxing the way that she sings and even though i'm cleaning 
I love listening to relaxing music while I'm cleaning and she is just, her voice is so soothing. So I apologize for my ugly dancing, <laughs> but I promise, I promise not to do it the whole video, hopefully. <laughs> to let you guys know that I'm doing this through pain. My back hurts and I'm doing a lot of bending over, which irritates it, but I need to clean. My husband does not clean like I do. So I've got to clean this stuff. Um, my sinuses are going crazy and it's because everything is dusty. Um, so that's what I'm trying to do. I also want to move things around because I'm just getting tired of the way everything looks. So I'm trying to move things around. I want to figure out what to do with my coffee slash cocktail table. I don't know what you guys call it. I grew up calling it a coffee table. So I, can't, I don't know if I want to leave it the way it is or if I want to turn it the other way. So I'm going to turn it the other way and see how it looks. Um, we have guests every week and um, they always hit their legs on it. And I always hit my legs. My son always hits his legs. My husband, everybody hits their legs because the lounge just comes out. And then there's really not that much area here between the recliner and the table. So I'm going to see if it needs to come up further or the recliner, but if, I, if the recliner goes back further, then there won't be space between my table and this. And there's no way an HE double hockey sits that I can move that recliner. I'm not even gonna, I'm not even going there. So. I gotta catch my breath. I don't even know if I told you guys, but they diagnosed me with asthma, so I have to be careful. Um, but I'm gonna try things, I'm gonna try things out, see how they look, and I really would like it if you guys could, um, leave me comments down below and let me know how you like it. Um, I'm going to move it and see what my husband thinks because ultimately it's up to him. Um, I have a lamp on my piano that we never use. I'm going to move it on his table because he always needs light. Um, I have a lamp on my table because I do a lot of work in my chair, um, Right now, I'm trying to do something with my, with my life. And um, it doesn't really involve my husband or my children, um, but it requires me to be on the computer a lot. And so I have to have that lamp to see my keyboard and to, um, when I'm filling out paperwork, I do it here at my, at the couch. Because there, I don't know if you saw me drape, the heating pad over the back of the couch but that is actually a um, moisturizing heating pad and it also has like a massage tool on it so it's massaging as well as more um heat heating it's like a wet heat so if that makes sense um it doesn't soak it doesn't soak that would be dangerous it doesn't soak but it's like um I'm sure you guys understand what I'm saying. It's like, it, I'm sure you guys understand. It's really difficult for me to explain right now. Um, I'm shaking really bad. I don't know if you can tell on camera. Um, so I wanna get back to cleaning and dusting. Um, I'm gonna move this black shelf organizer thing over into that corner because I'm gonna redo uh, Bella decorated it. She actually put it together for me and decorated it for me. And um, this is the one that was advertised. This is the one that I showed you guys in my last video. And um, so she built it and decorated it for me because I wasn't feeling so hot in that video. And um, I'm going to, I'm just going to redo it and kind of snap it up a little bit. Um, you guys are so talkative. I'm probably gonna let them out because they're fighting. But um, 
I've got two, I've already told you guys about that. But, mm, I got stuff I'm just gonna, that's in the living room. I'm going to, I'm gonna get rid of some stuff. I'm gonna, you'll see me bag up some stuff. Um, so I did just wanna stop and let you know that I'm doing this in pain. Um, but I'm not, I'm, I'm being careful not to push myself and to um, stop and take breaks, frequent breaks. Um, so I just wanted to see, to let you know um, if you see me doing stuff and don't think, oh, she must be feeling better because <laughs> I'm not. I don't have a migraine, so that's, that's a huge plus because those are super de debilitating. So I don't have a migraine, but my back is, is hurting, but I am pushing through the pain today to, um, to get my living room fixed up because I really, I'm really getting sick of, uh, it's just bland. It's just, it's, ugh. I want to paint. I want to redo my pictures. There's so much I want to do. And I just feel like, I feel like I'm strapped to a chair and I can't do nothing. So I'm going to do what I can with what I've got. So let's see what else I can do. So the little white spot right there and right here and back there, well, the pink thing is a stain, but you see the white, those are bird feathers. So they don't fight and like pull out each other's feathers. They, um, they just shed. That's just what parakeets do. They shed. So constantly we are vacuuming now the birds belong to my children so luckily they so luckily they are the ones that um vacuum clean up after these birds because the birds belong to them um i bought both birds for them and i i'm the one that buys all the products for them the food the toys the treats all of it um so and i bought this deluxe cage for them oh <laughs> So they got like a parakeet mansion over here <laughs> and it has the little um tray down there where their food and toys and stuff like that are their cage is dirty it needs to be clean my children will be cleaning the whole thing when they get home today they clean it every week on a friday yes they're so vocal today the sun is shining they, they just love the sunlight i'm gonna open the door for them so they can come out if they want to, which they will. You'll probably see me trip over them. <laughs> so, so yeah, it is the kid's um, job to, to clean, up, clean up after the birds. I'm gonna put you guys back on the tripod because I'm shaking like crazy. Um, oh, my hair, I look like Medusa. So, um, it's their job to clean up after the birds, and um, once a month we give them a bath. Um, well, they give them a bath, so they get bath today. Um, other than that, that's what they're getting today. We had blankets during the winter. We had blankets over their cage. Yesterday, I washed the blankets and I just put the sheet. It's a um, wool. What kind of sheet is that? thermal it's a thermal sheet and it's folded so it's it's still pretty it'll still keep them pretty warm um but it's not like thick blankets like she had thick blankets over their cage so um this will be this will be okay for them um probably when it gets hotter in the summer i'll put a thinner sheet on them but i think this will be fine for now um so i think i'm done talking <laughs> so let's, so I'm going to start vacuuming the, the bird feathers so that I can start moving stuff. I'm going to vacuum over here so I can kind of turn my table and see if I like it that way. Um, so. We were undiscovered, didn't care for one another, you and I. You and I thought I lost my way, but you washed out all the way. Don't know why. Don't know why. You got me high, but I'm so burned. You make me lonely when I'm by myself. I should be free, but I'm hoping that we can. Okay, guys, please let me know.
how this looks. I like it, but I like it because it's different for me. So, let me know how you like it. Look at this space. So much better. And through here too, so much better. I mean, the living room is, our living room is a pretty big size. And our last couch that we had in here was, it was just a couch and a love seat. So it did not, it did not take up as much room as this sectional does, but we are in love with the sectional, at least I am. My husband complains about it, but I love it. We do, there are a few problems with it, and I'm in the process of getting, oh you guys, I'm so out of breath. We are in the process of getting um, the manufacturer, because we still have a warranty with it, so we are in the process of getting them to come out here and um, take a look at it. Oh my gosh. I love this song. I can't let you. Can't let you listen to it, so I'm gonna mute this part. Okay. Um, let me know what you think. Let me do the recliner and the table and the lamp and decorate all that. And then you guys let me know what you think. Oh, oh no, no. I don't know what I could say to convince you to hang around. Starts racing, but I don't know if I like this chasing and playing and waiting around. It's a shame that my hands start shaking. Another drink and I'll go anywhere The way you smell like a flash 
watching the universe You are illuminating I don't really care about the people in the bar line I don't really mind all the who goes to and stage dives I don't care at all, baby, you got my attention So you would say yeah I don't see the logic of things It's quite a lonely world that we're living in Oh baby, you are something special, I'm sure Everything makes total sense when you're next to me With the with the organizer, but it's in the center of this wall, I think. So um, I'm just gonna leave it the way it is because, like I said, I'm gonna paint in here. So this this living room is not gonna be like this forever. Uh, eventually, I'm gonna paint. I'm gonna move stuff around. So um, everything's gonna be different eventually. So for now, this is how I'm gonna set it up. And then because um, I didn't like it over there. It was just where we put it at the time. So um, I'm gonna put my bird cage back in the corner and uh, I like that better. So let me put my little stuff, my tea, tea cup sets back on it. Okay, so I had to take a pretty long break because I had a heart attack. <laughs> um, the birds have disappeared. So they, I let them out the cage because I was working in that corner and they don't like it when the vacuum is going. So um, I went ahead and let them out of the cage. They were in this area. Um, so I had the front door open and there was a lot of sunlight coming in and wind. It's very cool in Georgia right now. It's probably like, um, high in the 50s, low 60s, probably mid 60s. So I have my front door open, but I have a screen on the front, you know, a screen on the front door. So they can't fly out, but there is a gap at the bottom, but I have a pillow covering the gap. So they can't get out. They're, they are stuck in the, house, <laughs> in the house. But I did freak out for a second thinking that they did get out. So, um, I was searching every room I went into my, I closed my daughter's room, but I didn't close the bathroom I did, and I didn't close my son's room. I don't know why I didn't, and I didn't close the office. So, um, and I apologize for my boys. I don't know what it is, but it just, it changes for random reasons. 
it may be allergies I don't know but um I checked every room I checked my son's room I checked the office I checked no yeah I checked the office I looked in the office I checked Bella's room even though it was closed I checked um, the bathroom right here in the hall and I checked the guest room and then I started closing all the doors except for the guest room because I'm going in and out of there um, and then I would check the office which is right here behind me and the light was out like it's like it is now um, so and then I got really scared. I was like, well, what if they squibbled their way out of this screen door? So um, we have cameras and I have one right here pointing at the door. So um, I went and watched that video and they did not get out the door because it points right at the door and you can see the bottom of the screen. So I watched that video and they did not, they did not get out. So um, while I was in there though, I heard them squibble at each other. So they are in that room somewhere. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna finish up in here and I'm gonna vacuum in here, put everything away, um, and then I'm gonna come vacuum in here and see if I can chase them out of there. Um, but uh, they are naughty birds today. And I'm also, say I have to dust the fireplace and my piano and that table over there. And then I wanna put a, I have a, okay. So I put a vase with, um, this like velvet eucalyptus eucalyptus leaves on that table and I want to put a spring decor on this table over here because I have bluebirds on my coffee table which is spring decor and I want to put something on my table over here I don't know what I'm gonna put yet I've got some stuff on the bed in here um, but I have a little greenery right there I may put on on there um, I don't, I'm not sure yet but I will look at the stuff that I have and see what I'm gonna do. I have stuff down here in the floor that I'm gonna get rid of. Um, but other than that, that is all that I am. I have to do out here. And then I'm gonna vacuum the office and see if I can chase them out of there. Um, because I looked, they sounded like they're behind something and I was I can't pull stuff out um, to look because the, the furniture is too heavy. So, um, I'm going to wait until my husband and my kids get home. Um, I did try to call my husband and tell him what's going on, but he's really busy. So, um, he's going to call me when he goes to lunch. Uh, my diffuser's not working, so I don't know what's going on with that. Um, I was diffusing some Panaway, hoping to, um, have that going while I was working to kind of help even out things. Um, my back is hurting, but I was hoping that that would kind of even out things to where it, it wouldn't hurt. And um, I am stopping in increments and just kind of massaging my back myself. <laughs> and um, it seems to help. So um, right now I'm going to put all my little stuff on these shelves. I went ahead and dusted the system. So um, I'm just gonna start putting everything back on there. So let's get started. Shy. I will let my guard down. I want to laugh out loud. Talk a little deeper, kiss a little harder. I want to laugh out loud. Talk a little deeper, kiss a little harder. Love a little louder. Love a little Them bruise. Even though it hurts, I won't show it to you. Cause it will ricochet, I won't let it bite. I will look at you and tell you that I'm alright. Like a ricochet, it will come back to you. Cause I don't care about you anymore. You can't hurt me like you did before Let me tell you Not because my eyes are open Your words will keep bouncing away And even if you're trying to hurt me My skin's getting thicker each day I don't know how you fall asleep at night Knowing that your words are hurtful It's just not Yeah. 
for now because my other elephant is plugged in behind the piano so um i can't get to it right now so um let me know what you think i've got pictures of seth and bella on top my tea sets and then my little elephants um i might have a few more i think i have a crystal elephant that i can add to this um but i think i think i like it let me know what you guys think in the just in the comment section and um, feel free, don't don't be afraid to hurt my feelings. I want honest opinions because if it doesn't look good, I need to know so that I can move it around, you know? So, actually I have an idea. I like that too. Let me know what you guys think. It says welcome. And it's got butterflies on it. And it is kind of wobbly because there are bars right here. Now let me know what you think. Please. Pretty please. With the cherry on top. <laughs> okay. I'm going to dust this nasty piano. But I want to show you something first. These are jellyfish, and Seth painted this in art class. Isn't this amazing? I think it is. I did a lot of bad things, and never did I give in just cause the thought of being.
I've done to my piano so far. I brought the vase, this big vase over here. It was over there beside my um, fireplace, but I decided to bring them over here. The other one is on the other side of the piano, but I made sure to dust it really good and put the um, place shine on it. Um, and then I just decided to put vases over here instead of um, doing any kind of other. I wanted to keep it really plain and simple. So I think this looks better than the other way that I had it. Um, I wanted to leave a little piece of greenery here. Um, so here's my other vase. And then I have stuff that I use right there. Um, I kind of push it behind the, um, behind the wall. Uh, <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me behind the piano so nobody can see it and then the little, little the little elephant that I'm gonna get my husband to unplug for me and I still am gonna get all that stuff out from under there too um, but I've had this vase for years and I've always had it on my fireplace but, but, but like behind the TV so I'm you know I was like this is just too pretty to hide so I decided to put it right there and then I wanted to put my wedding picture right there in the middle but I cannot find it so I just put my elephant loves right there um but i just think it looks i think it looks really good you guys let me know what you think um at some point i am going to get some uh cut flowers and put in these faces probably not these two over here but um i will do these two over here and I'll, what i'll probably do is put one of them on this side so it'll kind of even it out but i like it you guys let me know what you think in the comments below but this is my piano. I'm the best thing that has ever happened to you. Here's your time to shine. Oh, show me what you can do. The way my hands feel on your body. The way we're dancing in the dark. With every move I make, you're falling. The way my lips feel on your body. The way we're moving in the dark. With every breath. We take your falling I ain't got no time for romance But baby, I don't want to lead you on Not looking for something steady Not ready for that I'm the best thing that has ever happened to you Here's your time to shine oh, Show me what you can do Make a move The way my hands feel on your body We were dancing in the dark With every move ugly swaying and the ugly dancing but um I'm gonna take a break it's like 10 a.m. around 10 almost 11 probably I don't know but uh, my clock is broke behind me but I'm gonna take a break um I haven't eaten like all morning I had two cups of coffee and some water and now I'm gonna drink that body armor or whatever it's called it's pretty good, um, but I'm gonna drink that. I have a water here that I haven't finished, and um, my lunch is in the microwave and it just finished, so I'm gonna eat that. And um, one of my friend's videos just went live, so I'm gonna watch her video while I eat. And then once I'm done, I'm gonna get up and get right back to it. I'm going to, um, I gotta dust my fireplace and that table there, and then I'll be done with my living room. Oh, I'm gonna vacuum some more, and then I'll be done. And then we are going to clean the bird cage. And I'm, if I can get the birds down, I'm going to give them a bath because they need it. Okay, see you in a bit. I had spaghetti for lunch. It's those little smart ones. Um, it was like a little spaghetti dinner. It's like 280 calories. And that is actually my breakfast and lunch. I really don't eat breakfast. I know it's really important that you should, but um, I'm just not really hungry for breakfast. And um, cutting that out, and just watching my portion control has really helped me lose weight. Um, so I just, I just 
keep doing that. And really, I've eaten, I eat maybe once a day, maybe twice, and they're very small meals. Um, but um, I'm going to get back to work now. Um, let me turn the light back on because I turned it off. You got it kind of dark in here. Mm, okay. So I'm going to put all these trinkets in that box. I'm going to get finished dusting my baseboard and my chair rail. And then I've got to dust my fireplace. And I'm going to move things around up there. And then um, I've got this table that I need to clean. And I want to um, put a little spring thing on there. I don't know. I've got to look around the house and see what I've got. Um... But everything else is looking good. I really love how um, everything is turning out. I know my table's got a lot of junk, but as soon as I clean it off, it'll look better. But I just love the way everything else is turning out. Um, but once, and then this corner's empty, I'm gonna clean the birdcage and I'll um, include that in this video. And um, you guys will get to see how I do that. And I wanna wash the birds, but and I want to videotape it, but um, I don't know if I can get them down off that frame. I'll have to see if I can do that. Um, but this is how everything is looking right now. And once I'm done with everything in the living room, vacuuming, everything, I will make sure to give a whole um, 360, um, 360 view of everything so that you can see that um, everything is clean and picked up and vacuumed.
I haven't done a video like this probably ever. I don't know, but um, the living room just kicked my butt. I dusted everything and I moved things around. I love how it looks. I've got to um, put stuff away now, but um, once I finish putting everything away, I will give you the 360 um, look at it. But right now I'm gonna clean the birdcage while they're in the office. Once I get it clean, I'm gonna try to um, get them out, get them down so I can give them a bath. But um, right now I'm gonna focus on cleaning their cage real good. Um, and I, I'm gonna I'm gonna put that in this video. Just kind of give you guys something else, something different to, to see. So let's see what I can do. you our conversation takes to paying it some interest from time to time. Inside all that greatness in all of your adventures, you're all alone. Hold up, hold up, baby. I can sit beside you while you're going on about your simple life. Nothing left you thinking that maybe you're not different Some sort of an addiction 
Got this feeling I'm feeling you could be the one I see no reason Why I should ever let you go mm. Don't wanna wake up If I'm dreaming Because you know I can't get enough Of this feeling you're giving me Don't wanna wake up Wake up, don't wanna wake up without you, baby, without you. So I've got the, I've got clean foil. They have a clean pan and clean grate down there. They do stand on that grate sometimes. I'm only able to put one perch bar in there now because the other one did get soaked. And I have it outside now drying in the sun. I don't know if we're gonna be able to use it, but um, I guess we'll have to wait and see. And um, they've got their treats still in there and their nest. I kind of put them in the corner and kind of lower I may have to raise them up, I don't know. But um, I'm gonna have to turn that one a little, I guess. But I wanted them kind of in the corner like that. And then up here at the top, I just went ahead and put the two white swings side by side because they like to be next to each other. So hopefully they will like this setup. So now I'm going to go ahead and put the stuff back on the bottom and I'm going to roll it back into the living room. Oh, and I'm gonna put the food and water. I'll probably roll it back into the living room and then add the food and water.
going this way so thankfully I am getting towards the end of this video because um I don't think I can do anymore but let me do the bowls of food and water and then we'll be done Okay, my friends, I'm going in it here. I picked up everything that was in here that needed to be picked up. And um, I have I have moved things around. I have decorated. I love the way everything looks. It smells good in here. I've got my elephant diffusing and um, everything is clean and dust free. My sinuses are still going crazy, but whatever. Um, I'm tired. This took me half the day. I started about 7.30, 7.45 in the morning and it is almost one. So um, I guess it took me more than half the day, but my living room is clean. I even did a little bit of cleanup in the kitchen, but um, I didn't do a whole lot because I want to make a whole other video in my kitchen deep cleaning like I did in my living room today. I don't know when that'll be. Um, I'm hoping I can do it next ne my next uh, coming video, but we shall see. So um, I will post this up very soon and I hope that I was able to give you Hello, <laughs> I hope that I was able to give you guys some uh, great motivation today. Um, and I hope you guys enjoyed my video. I hope I didn't bore you too much. I hope you enjoyed my music and my um, ugly soyan and my ugly dancing. I hope I didn't embarrass myself too much. <laughs> Be sure to leave me a comment below. I love hearing from you guys. If you're new, be sure to subscribe. I would love to have you as part of my uh, growing YouTube family. And I will see you at the next one. Bye.